All right, dudes, this one is not nearly as tight as the previous one, but I um, think it can be a little, you know, a little tight. Uh, there's really only two main bullet points for this. It's a three-stage story. The first two stages are very straightforward. First one, you just have to drift a little bit. The second one's just some driving. Neither of those are tight and difficult. For this one, uh, you have to beat the time limit. Time limit can be a little tight, but it's not terrible. Really, you just got to do some clean driving, kind of like the first one. And right here, and then on the next sharp left, are your two big time saves. Really, just make those turns kind of clean. It doesn't have to be even perfect, as you can see, that one was not. Um, but just make sure that on these two turns, you make them at least somewhat clean and you don't go spinning out. Because if you spin out, you'll lose two or you know two or three seconds and that's about all the leeway you have on this whole race uh, other than that no braking no downshifting uh, just try to drive fairly clean this is actually a fairly sloppy run and we're gonna make it anyways and then um, <clears throat> this last big uh, cross-country turn he'll call it uh, make sure you kind of make that one without spinning out or fishtailing too much anything like that and then after you make this turn right here, uh, just try to get through here with some amount of speed. The shortcut he's talking about is to the left. Angle towards those trees and drive up here. This is where you're going to shave off the several seconds you need to make the timer because it's zigzagging through that stuff takes too much time. Take that shortcut right through those trees. Straight away, just, you know, enough speed. You have to hit this checkpoint with at least about two or three seconds left. So if you see on your timer that you're, you don't have at least three seconds to spare when you hit that second to last checkpoint, you're not going to make it. Um, pretty straightforward on that one. There you go. We'll catch you on the next one.